Welcome. In front of me is a Huawei P40 Pro and today I'll show you how to change the wallpaper on the device. So to get started, what you want to do is just pinch the screen. So let's do that right now. I will give you these couple options on the bottom of the screen. So stop on wallpapers. And here you have all the preloaded wallpapers that comes with the device. So you can choose from either one of those. Um, you can also go into your gallery, although I don't have anything entered. That's why it doesn't really show any photos. Uh, but you can find ones if you have downloaded some from the uh, from the internet or you can also go here to more wallpapers and this will open up the the Huawei theme store uh, so from here you can access basically all the wallpapers that that people have I guess shared I think I'm not really exactly sure and simply um, you can tap on it as long as you are logged in as you can see, there is a good one. Uh, but once I tap on login, it will tell me to, there we go, log into Huawei ID. You cannot download it without actually logging in. So that's kind of, uh, that's a bummer, but oh well, what you gonna do? Uh, if you wanna use Play Store, you can't. <laughs> so once you log in, you can actually download them. Keep in mind that some of them are actually paid, uh, primarily the live wallpapers, the ones that move. A lot of them are basically paid ones. So let's just see if I can, there we go, as you can see, buy. Now it doesn't look like they're cost a lot. Uh, it's uh, 50, uh, 50 cents, so about, uh, what is it gonna be like, 15 cents, I think. Something like that. Even I think less than 15 cents. So the price for them isn't necessarily like huge. Uh, considering it's a wallpaper but some of them actually might be more expensive i don't know haven't tried tried it yet there it is actually 150 so that will be about 40 cents so it looks like they're individually charged and probably based on whoever created them they can probably change the price that they want for it for some reason, even though their live wallpapers doesn't really show them moving right here, even though it should, maybe you need to log in for it. I don't know. But you can access them from basically the wallpapers. Uh, so actually, let's go back to changing the wallpapers because I haven't chosen any. So here I have ones that I can actually use. So let's just choose one, tap on it, and you can actually move it around in here to set it to the place that you want. You can also set a blur if you want to. As you can see, they become extensively blurry. You can tap on it again to disable it. And also, uh, you can set it to slidable or not. So, there we go. Once you have positioned it as you want, you can tap on the check mark and it brings up the window where you can choose uh, where you want to set it. So you can set it as a lock screen, home screen, or both. Just tap on both as an example. And now my lock screen will have the same wallpaper as the home screen. So let's just leave here. There it is. And also right here. So that is how you would change the wallpaper. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.